Talk. Hi everybody, good morning. Can you say good morning? Good morning. Good morning. This week we are learning about what Jesus says about worrying. Okay, Mama's going to talk for a minute, okay? Okay? Um, we're learning what Jesus has to tell us about worrying. Do you ever worry about stuff? And so to think about worrying and what Jesus has to tell us about worrying, we are going to do a special experiment. And that experiment involves... Hey guys, what's this? Snow. snow! How about all that snow we've gotten this week, huh? That's been pretty fun, right? Well, so in the Bible, Jesus says, don't worry. He says you don't need to worry because God is looking after you. But sometimes it can still be, you know, we still worry, right? And worrying is hard because worrying usually doesn't make things better. But worrying can really control us and be hard for us, right? And so... Um, to think about worrying, we're going to do a little experiment, and that's why I have my uh, assistants here. They really wanted to help with the experiment. Um, and so, imagine that this is your heart, right? Your heart inside of you. Your heart that loves God and that God loves. Now imagine worry. What's something that we worry about? Maybe we worry about school. And that snow is like the worry, right? And it covers the heart. And imagine maybe we worry about someone we love and that worry covers the heart. And imagine we worry, maybe we worry about friends. Maybe we worry, I don't know, about the weather. Maybe you have some special worry that you know about that I don't know about. And we imagine that too. Cause so that bucket. Yeah, it's a bucket. So now, all that worry is covering the heart. Can you even see the heart anymore? Yeah. Not really, right? Where did the heart go? Yeah. Is it covered in snow? Yeah. yeah. This hair dryer is like God's love. It represents loving God and trusting God. And so when we have worry, how do we get rid of it? We need something to replace that worry. Something to actually help us get rid of that worry. And so imagine this hair dryer is like God's love. And watch what happens when I turn it on. When we trust in God and remember that God loves us and is taking care of us, the worry melts away. Now this doesn't mean that we'll never worry. This doesn't mean that we're never gonna have hard times or watch people around us go through something hard that we worry about. But it does mean that through I'm all worried. of those worries, <laughs> the baby is crying. It does mean that through all of those worries, we can trust that God loves us and is with us and wants to carry those worries for us, that he knows our hearts, he knows those worries, and he is bigger than those worries. And his love, trusting in God, can melt those worries away. So you can learn more about this lesson, you can learn more about where this comes from in the Bible by going to oldtown.cc slash children and checking out this week's lesson. I hope you'll take a look and we'll see you next time. Have a great week. Can you guys say bye? Bye. bye. bye.